Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. The Nigerian singer Skibi is having a double celebration today as he unveils his new house that he just bought. And today is also his birthday. Let's check the biography and profile one of the most celebrated Nigerian musicians named Skibi Mayana, aka Swagali of Africa. You must have heard of this talented young man, previously signed onto five music star. This Sensima Kuruna was born on July 5th and he grew up in Surulere area of Lagos State. He is also of Yoruba descent. He was born at Bay in Laez, now recognized by his stage name Skibi. The name Skibi originated in his early years when he found an uncle of his, nicknamed him the Lad Skibi. According to report, he got a stage name Skibi from his uncle, which means a smart and sharp person. And Mayana is a Spanish word for tomorrow or future. For his education, he has a bachelor's degree in mass communication from the University of Adwekiti, which is now known as Ekiti State University. He is a graduate of Ekiti State University, where his professional music career also started from. Skibi's love for music started way back in his early high school days, where he was a popular rapper. Before his professional musical career started, after his high school education, he got to study the increased influence of Afrobeat sounds. Hence, he switched to secular music. For Skibi, music has always been a stream. He revealed this in 2014 in an interview. And in his words, music has always been a me. Music is my life. I started music when I was in GSS 1. I started with rap with my friends. However, Skibi encountered a number of challenges when he made the announcement to his parents about his choice of career. When he made this intention known, his mother was a bit skeptical about his choice, but didn't say a word about it. His father, on the other hand, side, was strongly against his idea of becoming a music chef or getting involved in any music-related activity. According to this talented musician, Skibi, he has no specific genre of music. His personalized sound is termed good music, which is a fusion of dominant genres including pop, reggae and R&B. He gets his inspiration by being alone, sitting and listening to old school music. How old is Kibi? He was born on 5th of July 1992, he is currently 28 years old. It was on December 24, 2014 that he officially joined 5 Star Music. This contract was inked after he met Casey and Imoni. It was a lavish signing which got him a brand new 2014 Hyundai SUV and a nice apartment for his start. Before this contract, he has actively been involved with Casey. He was also madly involved during Casey's signing days with Presh. He had fun at it, appreciating the five music star platform. During his signing, according to this music merchant, this was what he said, I've been with five star for two years and since Casey split with Presh, we have been working together doing good music. It feels really great. Five Star Music is a very big platform. A lot of people have been expecting my song. I'm finally releasing a single. So happy. Skippy told Encomia in 2014. He released his first official single in January 2015. The song was widely accepted and rated very high. It was a catchy dance auto, which featured the record label flagship at KC. The visual of the highly accepted song was subsequently released the following week. The video amassed over 63,000 views just about a week of release. Skippy also was featured in a single by producer Chimbale titled Kilimanjaro. Other acts of the song include Harry Song, Debbie J, Design, Austin Gray, World, and Young Easy. Fast forward to February 2019, Skippy turned to be one of the greatest Nigerian musicians who is now dining with the biggest meet in the industry. Also, his great hit in 2019, Sensima, brought him very far. His hit single, Sensima, also featured his usual collaborator, Ricardo Banks. Ever since KB came to the limelight, he has been dropping hits back to back, and his stars told their joints, That's How Stars Do, featuring Falls and Tenny, is also one we cannot forget. The word Sensima is a slang, it refers to when something is on point. Skibi has like three to four songs that are dance soul songs. He also has some other kind of songs. He has love songs. He has inspirational songs like Ayemi. Ayemi is inspiration or a prayer song and an encouraging song. Or why he left five star music? For Skibi, he has grown to that level where he thinks he should have his own record label and he wanted to stay on his own. He had a mutual agreement between himself the CEO, E-Money, and then KC. The name of his label is More Grace Music. 
A single Sensima, which was released in 2019, totally changed his career. And according to this music star, he met the song's producer to the for the first time at a Lagos recording studio when he went to get a different song mixed. Susie followed Skibi around the studio, hoping to get the chance to work with him. At first, Skibi found this persistence annoying, but after the two men were rightly introduced, Susie was able to share some of his work with him. The moment Skibi heard the infectiously rhythmic beats for Sentima, his mind was made up. Skibi would add his close friend and frequent collaborator Ricardo Banks to the single, and together they produced one of the biggest party records of 2018. As if to prove that Sentima was no fluke, Skippy returned a few months later with Oh My Ma, a song that showcased two things. First, that the singer had found his own sound, and second, that he could deliver eight songs without a star guest. Skippy followed those songs up with That's How Stars Do, a collaborative effort that featured DJ Neptune, Tony, and Fowles. A rapper who only a couple of years prior was believed to have dissed the singer. That was a remarkable turnaround. Congratulations once again and happy birthday to this Nigerian singer, Skibi.